What's up, Vibers? Ah, it is day two of summer vlogs. Um, it's morning time. Ah, I gotta eat my breakfast. Ah, and the only shirt I love to death is my Frosty Flex. Um, so I'm gonna go downstairs. Um, make me a bowl of cereal. And you guys gonna come with me? So right now I am doing my class work. I am on Delta Math doing my math work right now, and then I'm gonna go finish my ELA work. And around 12 o'clock, I'm supposed to go on um, Google Meet with my um, ELA teacher so she can talk to us. So as you can hear, I'm currently in um, my ELA class. She is um, t first she's talking about the book, but then she's kind of comparing it to the protest and stuff we're doing for George. So a lot of people are expressing. Um, <laughs> you know, outrage over the destruction of property and um, looting and things like that. So when the looting first started happening, it, it brought back to mind for me when Hurricane Katrina hit New Orleans. Yeah, she's and just teaching us, like, she's like a really good teacher, an amazing teacher. Completely um, next year I'm supposed to have her in uh, African American studies. So, so she like, she's really good. Like, she lets you know, like, if you think you know something, she's going to inform you more about it. Like, that's why I love this class and I love this teacher. So, guys, I decided that I really, really need to start cleaning my room. Because I need my room clean for when my birthday comes. Because you don't know who's going to come over here, you know? So, I, my room is a hot mess right now. It's just being home. I don't know. It just never inspired me to clean. It just made me fat. And kind of more of a slob. Like, I just like that. I had the attitude where I'm going to get it to later. But... It's like it's not inspiring me to clean, but and right now I'm inspired to clean, cause I I I mean I'm not gonna lie, I hate looking at my room and being a hot mess, can't lie, but from like whenever I'm from like all over these months, if you watch my room tour, my room got a mess, so be prepared. I feel like the first thing I should like start with is the um, dressers. I have a lot of flipping clothes and I'm not gonna deny it. I am a clothes hoarder and I have an addiction. I love clothes. Like look at my closet. It's overcapacitated with clothes. And then I have clothes in my attic. Like I'm a clothes hoarder. But I need to really look through these and get rid of clothes that I know I'm not gonna wear. I, if you are like someone that loves fashion and clothes and all that stuff, you always have that mind. You're always gonna have that mindset. The moment you get rid of it, you're gonna start thinking about it. Be like, damn, why I get rid of that? I got that. You like, you think you have shoes to match it now and all that, and then you get rid of it. Like, but uh, I hate this thing. Cleaning is so hard. How does somebody? How do you? Clean addicts do it. Huh. Oh. oh. 
this cheapo chair. One of the wheels came off. And every time I keep putting it back on, it keep breaking off. Like the fuck. here you see it's like a mess i don't know why it looks a mess because it wasn't even a mess that long ago i just I just cleaned it last week and it's a mess but i'm gonna fix it i'm gonna fix it i'm gonna fix it so this bag i filled it up with all my like flat iron blow dryer and stuff so this is just where all my blow dryers and stuff go. My hot comb. Curling iron. This is where all they are gonna go. It looks so bunchy over there, but I don't know why, man. I don't know. I had to put my scissors up. This is why I'm putting on my combs and stuff right in here. Now, I know this area look a hot mess. I know, I know. Oh, there's still socks here. My sock drawer is crazy. I'm a sock addict, and I'm a, and I'm proud to admit that. This gotta go <laughs> for your beauty. The bangs on Target here. Yeah, that gotta go. Um, Me trying to make this night nice. Ugh, in a way. Uh, eh, made some kind of difference. It's kind of sort of different now. Uh, uh, I'll work on the bed. <laughs>
my bed don't look good right now. I know there's a lot of blankets over there, but I know it look good. I have no idea where the pillowcase is to that, so I just like put it over there. It's fine though, because when I sleep, I sleep wild, so that's why the pillowcases are off. Like, don't ask questions you don't want answers to. So, right now, it's like my room isn't that dirty. It's just I have to get these bottles up. Um, those are all my book bags, like, that's my, um, computer book bag, school book bag, and my travel bag. And I just need to get that organized, um, like I said, get these bottles up. Um, maybe kind of organize this a little. And my room is actually fantastic. Talking about a bookcase, we're not cleaning this damn bookcase. It's... It's good to my standards. That's all that matters, right? Right. So, let's still organize. So, I'm just, like, cleaning it out because it is dirty. I love Jolly, Jolly Ranchers, so it's going to be filled with a bunch of Jolly Ranchers. <laughs> and it's change. Change with me. Um, the mask is going to stay in there. More change. Okay, that's clean. These are all my, um, some, most of my new SD cards. And my hand sanitizer. I really need to start using it. I don't even use it. I just leave it in there, you know, emergency purposes. Yeah. Okay, I have my old SD card and my headphones. So we're just going to put that back in there. A little what's in my bag, you know, the pen. Oh, these need to go in there. My, um, these morning shit, uh, my moisturize, my lotions, lotion. And then that's fine. Um... To you guys, it might not seem a lot, but it's, it's, it's a lot for me. Because this room is actually not that easy. I know it's easy to keep your room clean. For me, I'm just too stressful. I have too much stuff going on. Just keep it clean. But you know what? I made an effort. And honestly, this is a big difference for me. This is a big difference. And I got some shoes up, but... Um, so right now I'm about to go eat, I am have my smiley fries in the oven, but I have work at 5.15, so I have to, um, eat, take a bath, and get ready, so, um, I don't know, I might fill y'all in later, and close it out then, but yeah, guys, that's what I'm about to do, till then. So, guys. Right now, I got dressed. I took a bath. I got dressed for. I'm getting dressed for work. Um, I'm just wearing this blue um, carpenter top and my um, jeans. I'm only wearing this because it's hot and I don't wear a shirt. My work shirt over it. And I ain't trying to be hot with a long sweater on. So, it is right now 4 50 and I need to um, hurry up. Hurry up, cause work. I'm not trying to be late for. I feel like I look a hot mess. A hot mess.
I'm gonna go to work and I always tell myself before I go to work, I'm gonna have a good day. Nobody gonna mess up my day, et cetera, et cetera. You know. And hopefully it stay like that. Cause ooh, I be I try to calm myself down all the time. Make sure I do have my good good day. These customers. These customers piss me off. And I mean that in the nicest way possible. It's like, all right, you, you could have said dirt, but where are you starting with me? But, you know, I'm gonna have a good day. Good. Now I gotta leave for work. <laughs> I'm home. Oh, did you miss me? Did you miss me? I know technically it's probably like uh, what a minute for you guys, but it was a whole four hours. <laughs> yeah, a whole four hours. So I got back from work. I'm fine. I'm. I didn't have a bad day. It was nice and calm today. I wasn't serious. And um, me and my sweet tooth got me gushers and fruit roll-ups. I like to combine them together and I don't know make a um make a roll-up sandwich. I don't know you should try it if you really like candy like me but that is so bad. Um my mom's making food uh pork chops. I was in the mood with fries. I have a fry addiction I'm not gonna lie but I'm home I'm fine my back is killing me. It's killing me. I just want to sleep. But I'm probably gonna stay up, see if Corey Kenshin uploaded a video, and um, stay up till like 4 a.m. because you know I have nothing better to do. Probably start doing some homework. Uh, who knows? Um, I guess I'm gonna end it here. See and like finish some off tomorrow. Well, you see me tomorrow. But yeah guys that is it for this vloggy vlog, this summer vlog. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, follow me on all my social media. Make sure you check my recent content out and stay tuned for the rest of these summer vlogs. We have so much coming. And if you didn't check out if you I'm um, on this one, make sure you check out the last one. Make sure you stay tuned. We got this is the second day, so we got 19 more days, 19 more days. It just, <laughs> we got this. But yeah, guys, if you're not vibing with me, then what are you doing? <laughs>